I hope you have a very good reason for calling me out here. About an hour ago, two workmen who were digging the foundation for the IT center found four bodies in a very advanced state of decomposition. It seems that the site the workmen were digging at was an old Turkish graveyard. Those skeletons are 300 years old. Apparently, they died from the plague. That's why they're covered in lime. Mm -hmm. But that's not the interesting part. The bodies are not sufficiently decomposed for their age. Let me show you. One of the men cut himself on a skeleton mob. An ordinary cut, or so it seemed. But then, by the time the medical staff arrived, he was already dead. From the plague? So don't know. I want all these skeletons vacuum sealed as well as this body here. I'll inform you later about where to send them and keep this quiet for now, not a word. So you weren't sent to the exercise. I guess they had to leave someone in the city, Grandpa. I ain't your grandpa, Sonny. Come on, Grandpa. Relax. They called from the Department of Chemistry. They'll be here in a couple of minutes. Can't wait. <laughs> uh, excuse me. Can, can I just ask you, the, 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 the train from Romania, it's running late, is it? It just passed through. You didn't see? What, what, what do you mean, pass through? The trains aren't stopping today. You know, this big military exercise. You didn't see the sign at the entrance. I, I have to make a phone call. Cell phones aren't working because of this military exercise. Come this way. I'll let you use the phone. Watch out. The tanker is on its way. The station's closed, and... Here, the use this phone. Our armies carrying out in cooperation with the Lehne forces during this night are planned Dial to nine first. to the morning. With a demonstration of techniques for a release of hostages from the hands of terrorist groups. Hey! Fellas! It's illegal to cross the tracks. It's dangerous. Where are you headed? No worries, bro. This stupid exercise took so long. So we figured, why wait for morning when we can have a little fun before the MP finds us? <laughs> yeah, and we want to show our American friend how we party here in Serbia, right? Kurats, kurats, pichka, pichka. Here comes the spook. So that that's him. Prisoner six one one. That's your man. Why is he in solitary confinement? Has he caused any problems? That's the way it is. We'll get him ready. You're ready. 
hear you. I said you're lame. I said I can hear you. Don't move. So they send such a sweet things to get me. You're not going to shoot me, huh? There are enforced police troops outside this building. Do you really think you can run away? It's just my way to say thanks for the hospitality. my wife. She's going to wait all night at the station and I'm not going to turn up and, and she's going to call the police. And then there's going to be also women. They always assume the worst. <laughs> Come on, fellas. Move along. Yo, don't you move along to me, bro. You know what's you, not me? I always shit my pants when I see you scientist people. Ah, cool, cool that. <laughs> what is this? Where is security? Don't you go complaining to me. You want to spend the night at the station? Yo, don't you threaten me, man. You know who I am? You know who I am? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Easy. <laughs> yeah. What's the matter, chicken? Where's your courage now, huh? Stop joking. Give the gun back. <laughs> Shut it's up. loaded. The GPS is definitely not working. That's because of the military exercises. Probably. Um, we should probably, uh, s since the GPS is down, just use this map. You okay? Yeah. So we're we're here in um, Bershat. Bershat. Yes. Bershat. And uh, we just take this road, it leads through Panchevo, mm -hmm. right into Belgrade. Yeah, yeah, right. Yes. Yes. Okay. Concentrate. They're late. Mortimer Reyes is never late. Reyes? I thought we were going to be accompanied by some local cop. No, Mortimer Reyes, upon direct request from headquarters. 
You don't know who he is? <laughs> He's a living legend. He's from Texas, ex-CIA. Crossed over into Interpol 20 years ago when he married and took residence in Serbia. breakfast. You mean dinner? No, I mean Sarma. Everything's packed. We'll have to eat straight out of that. We have almost five minutes to eat everything. Dig in. When does the van come for the stuff? In the morning. Interpol asked for the two of us, Morty. Yes. One more case before I retire. And it all finishes before 12 noon. I can't be late. I want to get out of here on time. You've pulled this thing all together perfectly. Yes, of course. All planned. The shrink down at the station calls me a control freak. <laughs> uh, I drag so many years. So many memories. I'm sorry that you're leaving. I know. I understand. We've been through so much together. Now it's time to say goodbye. Somebody pick up the phone. Poison's gone. I, I was very worried about you. You, you. you know, everybody outside has collapsed. And Phone lines are still down. I, I, I can't get through to the ambulance. I can't get to the police. Uh, and I, and I... What are you doing outside? You know you shouldn't leave yourself until the demons inside you leave. The door was open. There was no one. You'd better go back. I've been attacked by a man. Sister, is this the day? 
Blessed is he who readeth and heareth the words of this prophecy, and keepeth those things which are written in it. For the time is at hand. For the great day of their wrath is come, and who shall be able to stand? Petrovich, sir. Petrovich? Yes. All right, Petrovich. We're on time. Aren't we? Of course, sir. That's what I thought. Mina Milius, it's really nice to meet you. I've read your file. It's incredible. I'm impressed with the most interesting parts on in the file. This is Inspector Bellish. Inspector Belich. Call me Dragon. Dra dragon? Oh, no, no, just Dragon. Uh, all right. Okay, this assignment is simple. All we have to do is escort the prisoner to Belgrave. From there, we transport him by plane to London. I know. I've been checking the route all day, but the GPS hasn't been working. Well, we expected that, didn't we? Everything's fine. If there ever was an easy assignment, this is it. We'll be done in a couple of hours. Of course, sir. Relax. This is your operation. We're here only as supervisors. That's what makes me nervous. <laughs> <laughs> You've met Agent Petrovich? Yes, I've met Petrovich. Agent Botton? Botton, all right. And Agent Savini's in the van. All right. Mina? Mr. President, I was looking for you in your office. I'm here. This place brings me peace. Relaxes me. Everything is running according to plan. Colonel Ironside stated that, I quote, in the first two days of the military manoeuvres, the Serbian army has demonstrated capacities and capabilities equal to those of modern military powers worldwide. That's good. I'm expecting a visit from the chief of bureau.
So, first time in the field. Shows that much, huh? Not quite. I read your file, too. You come highly recommended by the Academy. Well, with a laptop in my hands, I'm unstoppable, but with a gun, we'll see. Lena, you want to know something? I've been on this job over 20 years, and in all that time, I've only had to take my gun out of the holster twice. Just twice. And both of those times on assignments with me. <laughs> I'm your jinx, Mordor. <laughs> <laughs> Drag, if you say third time's a charm, you will have eaten your last bowl of sorrow. <laughs> Who's the prisoner? And why are we moving him in the dead of night? Well, actually, the file is very unclear. Agent Reyes, do you know anything more about the prisoner? That data is strictly classified. Your task is merely to get into London alive and well, and we're here to help you. Petrovich, you've been quiet since we started off. I just don't like the fact the mission is being run by a green rookie. Have a guess or what? No, I don't know. It's just that. What's happened? These guys left the party also. How far is this station? Can we walk there? Yeah, and look. Ah, save me! Jesus saves. Run! They, they, they've gone mad! Everyone thought I was mad. I wasn't allowed to leave the cell. But now... Now... We have to run. Run? This is how End of Days begins. This is the beginning of Armageddon. Cut off the serpent's head, and the body will die. Say it, save me! Get me out of here! P please, take me with you! Start the car! Start the car! Come on! Come on! Ah, ah. Everybody out! You stay away! Ah. Stay away! No, no, no! I'm not one of them! I. I. Ah. Oh, this is a nightmare! I shouldn't take those mushrooms in the kitchen. Here. 
I thought that at this time of night, you would be sleeping. I didn't think you would respond to my call tonight. Really? How could I refuse? After all, you are the president. Tell me. Operation Black Smoke. What is it? Black Smoke is an operation which has been running for decades. Twenty or so years ago, we encountered a very unusual phenomenon near the industrial zone in Panzerl, on the bones of ancient plague victims. What? It turned out that the plague virus develops an interesting trait when soaked in sufficient quantities of ammonia and benzene, and I'm not a chemist, so, so I cannot give you a precise explanation. Essentially, it brings dead cells to life. Welcome to Fancho. Why are you closing the window? Because of stench. They don't even need the welcome board. When it starts to stink, you are now you are in Pancho. And so, on the most routine of missions, you get to pass through the most toxic city in all of Europe. Not quite what you expected, huh? You wanna hear a funny part? People say that in these parts... <laughs> Mina? Yes? Tell Savini to wait for us at the next set of lights. Yes, sir. Petrovich? Contact the local police. Yes, sir. Mortimer. Nina, stay in the car. The laptop really isn't doing me much good right now. Watch the perimeter. Petrovich, have you reached the locals? Not response, just static. Mina, call Savini, tell him to get back here right now. Yes, sir. Thank you. 
Oh, hold on. Savini and Botnar answering. Oh. Mina, back to the car. Now, move it. Horny, let's move. Move, come on. Move. Move. Move, move. Come on! Come on! Fuck Yeah, yeah, I'm, f I'm fine. I'm fine. Petrovich, try reaching anyone. You understand anyone? Local police, school, cops, and guard, I don't give a damn who. Find somebody. Yes, sir. <laughs> Agent Svini? Agent Barton? Barton? Svini's dead, Dre. Agent Reyes, what about the prisoner? The man is out of commission. We'll have to transfer him to our car. Agent Reyes, I am in your line of fire. I found one. circumstances out here and we have to transfer you to another vehicle don't do anything stupid all right he's heard you open it aim for the head what i say aim for the head He's right. He's not moving. All right. 
Let's go. So you started without me, huh? Get out. Okay, easy now. Easy. We'll just get to the car and we'll move on. Move on. It looks like the end of the line to me. They're all over the place. What happened to them? We need to move faster. Yeah, I would love to. But these new shoes give me a terrible blister. Come on, come on! Is this some sort of war? Yeah. War of the world! What should we do? Mortimer? I think we should find some kind of local police station or something. Establish communication links and, and wait for backup. Okay. The closest police station is nearby, behind the park. Hector Lynch, get back into the car and start the engine. Move! Move, move, move! Come on! This, this one seems that. Why am I a victim? Where'd he go? Shoot him in the head! Shut up! Shut your mouth! I said shoot him in the head! Shut up! You wanted to become like those two who left back there? Petty one! Turn your match! Do you hear me? Petrovich is gone. Petrovic! Adios, Petrovic. Petrovic! Shut up! Mina, watch him. Tire's flat. We'll have to walk. The station is that way, behind the park. It's not far. Mortimer, release him. What? Release him, fast! Mina. So intimate. And how about we just leave you here, huh? Agent Milius! How'd you feel about that, huh? Mina! You should come with your cheerleader uniform. Mina! Why don't you give me a gun or something? My aim is very good. I'll bet. Come on. Is right there. Thanks. Thanks. Now give me back my gun. Did he bite you? Now I become like one of them. Feel free to pretend you don't see what's going on. We don't have time for this. Pull 
one more step like that, and I'll mess up that ironic smile of yours. For good. Let's go. Seems like we missed the party. Lines are dead. Can you contact the base in Belgrave by the network? Yeah, I mean, the system doesn't look like it's damaged, but there's no power, so we're gonna have to find a generator somewhere. we Will do. The one has gone on, hasn't it? The speed of a transformation depends on the severity of the bite. And how do you know all that? Well, let's say I just have a great instinct. Oh, well, just have to find some sort of first aid kit. Okay, right. Here's something. Oh, thanks. Where did everybody go? Probably out handling the riots. Right. Eaten, right infected, and probably both. You speak only when spoken to. Clear? Smile. You can bet your life on it. How do you feel? Like crap. Mina, Inspector Bellich and I, I'm gonna check the rest of the premises. If he moves, kill him. Gladly. Yeah. Mm -hmm.
They stopped banging. Do you really think they quit? No. Crap. To meet like this. Okay, don't move and shut your mouth. everything. There's no ammo, too. This is bad. I've got two more clips. You? One. We have to economize. You're sane! And you? Are you sane? Anyone hurt? No, we are all fine. But the gentleman behind the bars, he asks to lock him in. Sir? I I'm a professor. Let's go. Today, I I, I used to work at the library. Now it's all gone. All those books. The knowledge of dead civilizations. Everything will be fine, sir. We're with the police. I'm going to open this door. We're going back. We'll find a place where we will be safe. to tell her not to wait for me. Come on, let's go. More survivors. Great. Great. I'm I'm Agent Milius. any trouble. If he had been, he wouldn't still be sitting there. Don't pay no attention. She just cannot resist my boy's charm. When I got away from the station, I, I ran into some weird soldier. He, he was shouting about Armageddon is coming and how he'd been preparing for years. It looked as if he was right.
I'll send you back to whence you came. Now let's see, this prophet of the Lord. Which tool shall he reach for next? The flaming strength of the Lord. His will be done. The generator room is down this corridor. Oh. Wait, I have to watch this. No water for me. I saved your life back there in the park. I was hoping for a bit more recognition. I said thank you. I can't believe that my camera fell just like that. I can't believe that in the middle of this horror you're thinking about your camera. Yeah, but. It's probably the worst thing that ever happened since the beginning of civilized world. And I'm a part of it, and I don't have a camp. Isn't that shit just great? What is it now? Are you angry? Well, no. Never mind. Just worry about you, Banner. What do you worry about me? Somehow, you share a certain promise at the very beginning. But it doesn't take too long to see through this. Fear. Smell of fear. Yeah? Well, you smell of sweat. So this is your first case, huh? Hell of initiation, huh? Look, just keep quiet. I'll get you a glass of water, okay? Yeah, I've been quiet for too long. Illegally in prison without shred of proof. And as now as I'm walking through this city, and suddenly this. Crap. What are you playing at? You want me to believe that you're so important someone staged this whole thing out of spite towards you? Nah. I'm just a stranger in a strange land. Being that all my life. You talk too much. Jerk was right. How do you feel? The bite hurts. And the whole left side all numb. We've got to get to that generator drag. Put that bandage back. And let's go. I appreciate the fact that you're that you're trying to get my mind off of this and all, but but Morty, I won't be going with you. I thought you quit that. All that keeps me sane. Haunts you again. More than ever. More than ever, Drag. 
I'm so sorry. We'll talk about this later. This is not the time, Drag. I know. You okay? Why don't you find a robe and tie him down? He hasn't got far to go. One more word out of you. Mina! Listen, people. If he's been infected, why don't we shoot him right now? Shoot him! Enough! I see that one coming. Agent Reyes, what are you doing? We have to restart the generators. Bellage's injuries are too severe. If I take you, I have no one to look after him. This way, I watch him. Well, I thought cops had a better thing to do than become heroes. Currently, currently nothing better occurs to me. This ain't the Wild Wild West. Why didn't you take a look outside? Mina. Watch Bellage. He's getting worse. You know what to do if he starts to turn into one of those. Oh no, Agent Reese, I get I... This is a direct order. And we always obey orders. Yes, sir. All right, let's go. You, follow me. I'm just a reporter. I I'm not interested. You. Get up. I'm sure the generator's down there. I saw the blueprints of the building. Okay. Here goes. So what's to stop me? Shooting you right in the back and get the head out of here. That's stupid. You know that together we got better chances of lasting through the night. In a situation like this one, you're just slowing me down. Okay then. If you try anything, I'll kill you. And not by a bullet to the brain, but straight through your heart. So you can come back like one of these things outside. Ooh, the man is an artist. Art has nothing to do with it. I just don't like you. Cat. What? It's always a cat.
Siamese, huh? The brain. The brain is intact. The infected is now destroyed. How do you know all that? Chernobyl, 1986. Really? And you were there then? How old were you, five? I mean, my father. Let's find the damn generator and get the hell out of here. feeling never better why don't I get you some water <clears throat> listen you're you're just starting out in this job oh, please just don't talk relax just one thing this job can possess a man. It can become an obsession. Don't let it happen to you what happened to Reyes. What happened to Reyes? Oh, a, a stupid accident that ruined his life. The stupid obsession that made him go away on that on that day instead of taking his wife. She went by herself by train and She fell onto the, the train tracks. Don't let this job obsess you so much. Don't control your life. Don't let it destroy you. Don't. Don't. I'm blown to the head now. Please, Mina, please. What? Mina, please. Please. I'm sorry. Oh, what? Please. No. See this one? That's the only main switch. It's gonna turn automatically. Let's try it this way. Nothing happened. What are you doing? Sometimes you just gotta give it a kick. Seems some of your colleagues had the same idea. They're handed us the street. Quick, back. 
Go for the door. We don't care about the rest of them. He was... <laughs> you did what you had to do. Okay. Minister. Go. but the external link doesn't work. It's almost as if it's been shut down by Central. Well, this we got cable. That just to be punchable. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. This is, this is live, look. What? Do you see that? Park, I kissed for the first time. cast into the pool of fire. This is the second death. Don't. Can you operate the machinery? 
It's time we announce to the world what's happening out there. You understand? This is no good. Why don't you put a cartoon channel or something? Look. Come on, old man. How hard can it be? Lucifer invented those. Demonic That's him. Machines so that everyone can use them. That, that lunatic. You know, young, when all this ends, you shouldn't make an interview with him. I don't think I'll come back here ever again. Brothers and sisters, woe to the earth and to the sea, because the devil came down onto you, having a great wrath. And in those days, men shall seek death and shall not find it, and they shall desire to die. And death shall fly from them. Could you please turn this down? And I saw a city chained in concrete and iron. And I saw a city lapped by dark waters. And I saw a way to repent ourselves. A way to destroy the old serpent. To redeem our sins against a planet that we have turned into our plaything. To pay for the filth and toxic stench with which we have filled our seas and oceans jungles and the forests we have slain through our haughty carelessness and gross neglect. Please turn it out. You kill the serpent in the head. Please Fire at their heads. Blow apart their heads. Let me out. It's the only way. Let me out! Ah! Let me out! Let me out! This window leads to a side street, I checked. There aren't any of them out here. Come on. Professor? You go. Professor, you stay. <laughs> I know. But you heard the man. The end of the world is coming. Our civilization. Let's go! We've been watching its decline for decades, and now the end is upon us. And it's all our own fault. Our own fault. Your wife, she's still waiting for you. My wife? But she's dead. She died 10 days ago. I, I somehow forgot. Once again, Professor, why are you coming with us? There are far more horrifying things than what's happening to us now. To die and come back, this loathsome wandering, this without ever having known what it is to love and be loved.
dawn already. Looks safe here. So what's the plan? I think the only smart thing is to try to reach the river, to steal a boat, and reach Belgrade. Wait, maybe we should find some shopping mall or something. It'd be too hard to secure, and believe me, they would get in anyway. I think the river is a better plan. Yeah. Big shopping mall, definitely. Agent Reyes, what about your weapon? I have nothing. Mina? How many shots are left in yours? Whatever's left in the clip. Three, maybe? You? Empty. Enough time to get out of the city before the authority contains the outbreak. How do you mean? I mean Chernobyl. The nuclear catastrophe was a conscious decision. It was the only way to stop the contagion. What do you mean? You were there? My father used to work at the plant. Primary victims got killed by the gas come back to life. Secondary slain by the primary ones and also spread the infection further. And what about your father? Died. Twice. The river is dead. We're close. Look at them. That's so weird. It's as if they're all sleeping. You're the expert. What gives? No idea. This has never happened in Chernobyl. They didn't let it go for long enough. Maybe they're trying to get warm. Maybe it's too cold when you are dead. Whatever it is. That river is the only ticket out of here. So what now, Sheriff? Quiet, 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 I'm thinking. Okay, this is what we do. I'm going down there. If they stay still, perfect. If they rise, Mina, as soon as the infected come after me, run to the river. Run as if hell itself is chasing you. Clear? I don't think I'm gonna like this plan. You don't want me alone? This is Agent Melius's first field case. It would be a shame if she were not to complete it successfully, wouldn't it? Crazy man who used to run through the neighborhood and rant and rave. He was saying weird things. One of the things he used to say 
this sticks in my mind every time I look at this. He would say, hell is going to overflow and the dead will rise forever. Crazy old man. stopped. Oh, okay, wait for my signal. Let's go. Let's go. We gotta go faster. You guys, get down to the river, start the engine and wait. I'm going to get Reyes. It's obeying a direct order? Come on. Go. Are we still that fun? Let's go. Undo the ropes. I'll get the engine starting so we won't waste any time. Come on. Come on. Jan! Get me up! I ain't gonna wait Jan! for nobody. Nobody. Smells like the end of days.
come to me, children of darkness. The time of redemption is nigh. The only chance we have. This way! I've plenty of weapons for all. Let us drive this filth back to whence it emerged. I'm going after Reyes. Above go. Very quick. Primary victim. You disobeyed a direct order? I found the instructions unclear. Which part of Run and Don't Stop did you find lacking in clarity? All of it. The prisoner. Finish your mission. Yes, sir. Two guns, and I have a sword. Now, who's got better fighting chances? Well, I've got two empty guns. And I doubt you're going to come with me willingly. You know, I keep saying, what a shame it would meet under these circumstances. What a shame I'm out of ammo. 
Looks like the first field assignment has to remain uncompleted. Maybe one day we'll meet again. I doubt it. Lena? Prisoner? He got away? Yeah, he just disappeared. Of course. Doesn't really matter, my first field assignment was a complete disaster. I'll tell you about it. You certainly have proven your skills with a gun. I guess so. Mina. Good job. Thank you, sir. By the way, huh? one more question. Honestly, mm -hmm. who was the prisoner? Nobody special. <laughs> and he shall raise with his hands the sword of vengeance, the flaming blade of the Lord's retribution. And his eyes or is a flame of fire, and yet a name written, which no man knoweth but himself. Serbia.
Let's go, we're ready. Oh.